Welcome back to me and my brother's channel. Today he's doing drawing, of course. Come on, let's see how to draw. One point perspective. One point perspective. Okay, bye bye, one point perspective. And today we're going to learn how to do it. First, we have to draw a line a bit more at the top. A big, big line. Here, maybe here. So, a big line all the way to the end. Then, you could draw a little square right in the middle of the line. And you could color it in. So, it's going to be the tunnel. Then, you make a line here. And make another line going out like a V shape, just like a V shape, see? Pizza! A V shape. Not really like a pizza, but okay. Okay, now we're gonna put two lines together and make that like a rail track, obviously. And we're gonna do that again. Bigger and, again. and bigger. It goes bigger and longer and longer and bigger and bigger, obviously. If you don't think you're good at lines, you could like use a ruler. Okay, I'm bad at lines. I'll fast forward it. And then until you go all the way to here. And then, now, until I go to the last one. And now, you can start doing this. Look closely. So let's start with the big ones. So a little one right here. Turn here. Little one here, turn here. So, now that's going to be the real. Now you can color it in. And when you color it in, okay, now until you color it all, then you're going to have to do it. And I'm going to fast forward it now. Okay, I'm almost finishing it because I fast forward it and I'm almost done of the rail track. So, we're going to continue... I thought the rail track. Okay, now you see the rail track is done, right? Beautiful! Okay, we're not done. Now, from the, the point, the dot that we drew, right in line all the way here, and another line all the way here. So, you could draw A little, little box over here. Now, this is gonna be our house. Like a little house next to the rail track. And then you put the line here and the line here. And then you can just put it here. Then you can put another line here, which goes up there. And you will need a, a little line right here very lightly and then you can draw a little window and then you have to measure if the window is the right side with the door so it has to be and then now use your eraser to erase the middle part now if you want to get things better you have to think of like curving things and then now we're gonna have a chimney 
the chimney and then we're gonna have lines to the side diagonally and then we're gonna put it down 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 and down okay now you're gonna have a little little box over here so a little box over here and another one and then color that in and then you can color the whole place in but lightly not too hard because you won't see the window shading and now I'm going to fast forward everything right now because I need to finish my house and now make sure there's no holes out of it Mostly when you draw, you can use the 2B ones, so it goes better and better, whatever. And then, now you can draw, you can erase a part in front of the door, and then, now, you can draw, like, rock pedals for, like, uh, a place when you, like, get out of the place and it gets beautiful, so, draw two lines and the ending, so, draw little thing here, little thing here, little thing, just like a chess pattern. And then, until you finish it, and you can just like, continue from these thingies. Yeah, fun, right? And now color in those boxes that I told you to color in. Those boxes that you made, you have to color it in. And now, Look, hello, rock pedal. Exit. Looks cool. Cool, cool, cool. And make sure your lines don't get too long for the house. And you have to erase it if it's wrong. And then, on the other side, which is this side, you can think of like a little, another path or whatever you want. But today, yes. I'm going to draw a river. First, you need two lines right here. Now, inside, do this, this, and make sure it goes there until it disappears and you can't see. And here, the same. And now, erase the lines on the side. when you erase the side you could draw trees next to it but when you draw the trees please add a line here and then now you can draw the trees it could be whatever tree you want like normal trees like I'll just draw a kind of tree that looks like a Christmas tree maybe and then so I'm just gonna start from here color it in and then here, so it goes this this line. Ding 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 ding. Ding 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 ding. ding. Then you can color shade it in some kind of like shading. And then it's gonna be like a Christmas tree. But remember, rivers always have the shadow of the tree. Shadow it in until you go to the end. And now I'm going to fast forward it again. Because you won't want to see this boring part. After you finish all the trees, now you can erase the line. Okay, now you think of like a river. It has a shadow of a tree in front of it. So let's draw the shadow. So 
at the end, you're gonna add more details to this picture to look more nicer. So you always need the shades on the ground too, not just in the river. Shades are like the. When you get done of this thing, you just gotta feel like, oh my gosh, it's so amazing. And uh, let's just fast forward at this point because you don't like it. So now we could add the background because it looks very boring, just a little thing right now. So we could just add more details. So, like, we could add like a bush here, maybe. Or you could also add something like a fence, maybe. You could also add a few trees here if you want to. Like, if you really if you want to. So I'm just going to add some trees over here. And then we have our background. Okay, today I choose to have like mountains because it looks way better. But you could also do like a city. But today let's do mountains. And don't don't forget, don't draw a mountain like this because you need a tunnel to get through the mountain. Continue drawing your mountain until the end. The end must be flat, or else you can't draw your little house over there. Now you can draw your little house. Whatever you want, you can draw a big house, or a little house, or whatever you want. And then you could just add a little fence over here. And you could just add a little road to go down there. And then, just look. But if you want more details, you could actually add some grass here. Add some more grass here. And I'll fast forward my video for a bit. And continue with your grass. After the grass, you could like, just be done. So, if you don't want to watch it, just skip it. And, and if you don't know about how to draw houses, then you could just watch my other video about houses. Hey, thank you for listening, and if you want to watch more of my videos, please subscribe to my channel below, and see you next time. Bye!